commission for a civic guard portrait was rarely granted to a painter from outside the city. Quite exceptionally, Franz Hals, from Harlem, was asked to paint this group portrait. However, he soon found himself at odds with the guardsman, and the Amsterdam painter Peter Cotty had to step in to finish the seven figures on the right. Known for his small scale, very smoothly and finely executed works, Cotty nevertheless imitated Hals's loose style as best he could. This is one of Hals's most famous paintings, and one of the best examples of a portrait of a militia company. It was painted between 1633 and 1637. It shows a militia from Amsterdam, under the leadership of Captain Rainer Rail. He's the man seated at the left. Positions within the militias depended on the wealth and status of the members. House is perhaps the very first painter of large size group portraits. Two. Rather than portraying officers in a row creates a very dynamic interaction among them. There is all this interaction going on, which wasn't common in earlier portraits. Franz Hals the Elder 1582-1666 was a Dutch Golden Age portrait painter who lived and worked in Harlem. He is notable for his loose painterly brushwork, and he helped introduce this lively style of painting into Dutch art. Hall played an important role in the evolution of 17th century group portrait. Peter Jacobs's Cod was a Dutch painter of genre works, guardroom scenes and portraits. Life. Cod was a technically skilled painter. He is said to have studied with Franz Hals, but it is more likely that his training was with the portrait painter, innkeeper, actor and art dealer Baron van Sommeren, or possibly with Cornelis van der Voort.